Hello everybody, Common here. Uh, good day, good evening, good mid-morning, good midnight, good life. I hope everybody is good. Again, I hope you're staying out of trouble. Okay, so let's look at this for a minute. This is the Field Notes notebook, tactical notebook cover. I bought this, oh I don't know, now I'm looking at probably, I've been using it now for six, seven months, and uh, I got some pros and cons with it. Yeah, I actually like it, uh, but I do have some things that I don't like, uh, but I thought it would be kind of cool to show you guys. All right, so what is this thing? It's the, it's the Field Notes Notebook Cover by KK Zippers. You zip all the way around, or, you know, clamshell style. And then what we got here is, uh, you got four pins you can put in here. Some of the pockets, like these two pockets are not as big as, as these two, uh, because you can get bigger stuff in here. I have the Sharpie, like the ballpoint, not the ballpoint, but a Sharpie. It's a, a fine marker. I think it's point. 07 and then I just got a regular uh, pin uh, the pilot G2 and then I got a highlighter and then I got a red sharpie that I kind of like having the red one and I also sometimes will switch out with click sharpie that I have here if you haven't got one of these this is really cool you click it you don't have the cap to deal with but the only thing is is when I put it in here it does stick out a little bit and then I risk bumping it and there's a mess in itself. But the red or the regular Sharpie would fit in there perfect. So so this notebook, uh, it's pretty good. I mean, it's not a, it's not something I think, it's made for cargo pockets. I, although I have put it in my back pocket. It just, when you get it full and you get patches and stuff on it, it becomes pretty wide. And that's the part that's a drag. Now for cargo shorts or cargo pants, it works pretty good. I, I really think that's what it was designed for. Um, the guy that in uh, that made this is on YouTube. You can go check out his video and he'll explain a little bit about it. He's got all the measurements and everything. But as far as build and durability, uh, it's got really good stitching. I haven't ran into any issues with it and I use this thing. If I'm doing a project or if I'm going to the store a lot and then I'm going, you know, and getting, say I'm putting together a wood project or something, I take this thing and use it because it, it just keeps everything. You can put your receipts in here uh, and all that kind of stuff. And so, <coughs> excuse me. So uh, as far as Velcro, it's loaded down with Velcro. I mean, you got, and this is an elastic. And back in the day, this was for, I think an iPhone three or four because it would fit in here. But now our phones are like the size of this, uh, this mat here for cleaning your guns where the, this is not going to fit in there. I like to put deeds, not words on here because then I know I got to get stuff done. And it's kind of like my own mental, okay, stop talking about it and start doing it. All right, so it has a Velcro strip here, hook and loop. Uh, and then it's got four pockets, as you can see. It, it's a, it's a uh, 1080, I don't think it's 1080. Uh, I think it's the 6, 660. Um, because it's not as stiff uh, as as the 1080 would be. All right, so then it's got uh, good stitching back here, and it's got a pocket on the back which you can slip stuff in. And I'm a plague, sur plague survivor, so I decided I better put that on here. All Velcro back here too, hook and loop here. You can really, and that's the thing that will get you is you start putting patches on here and then that makes it even wider and it starts getting bigger and bigger and pretty soon you're like dude all right where do we stop with this thing but as far as you know kind of a cool thing to carry and have all your stuff in one spot it, it's okay it's not it's not a big you know it's not like a total you know on a scale of one to ten is ten being perfect I'd give it a two you know but it's not like that it's about a seven and I, and I would grade it on that because of the width that it actually gets because you can't it's not like you can 
stick it in your front pocket or if you were to take like let's open up here if you were to take this field notes notebook out and you could put that anywhere and it would fit fine but then you know you'd have to keep a pen or pencil with you someplace but that's the reason I give it that that uh, rating and then on here you got a hook and loop here hook and loop here and you got a pocket here the loop goes all the way down which I just think they you know they designed it and built it that way and then in the back it's got hook here and it's got uh, I'm sorry loop here and it goes all the way to about right here in it so uh, down in here things will slide in and out easier receipts or you know maybe you got some uh, notes that you've written and you tear them out and you can put them in there the field notes notebook slips right in on either side you can put it however you want it you can put it where it's both uh, inside where you open it up and it opens up to what you want to do and that, and then or you can put it on this side or I just I just threw it on this side because I thought it would be a better location for it and it slips in it's it's designed for that and there's your tactical notebook cover it's all field note made in USA and then uh, on the back all loop again and a big pocket that goes all the way down you know and you can put other stuff in here too you know but then you you know you run the risk of that sticking out but as far as like like I don't know like a cool notebook <laughs> it's kind of fun to have it you know uh, it wasn't that expensive uh, but the only thing again is that, you know when you go to put it in your pocket you're like well what in the heck here but I mean you have it all with you you know then I run the calculator on my phone uh, if I'm doing something and then I can put all my measurements and all my stuff in here uh, this is the grid uh, field notes and uh, and so it you know it all zips up inside so you know waterproof well it's it's that it's that material that's water you know it's not like you're gonna throw it and submerge it but it's waterproof if it gets wet or gets in the rain um, and so it's just one of those things where it's like, you know, this ain't a bad deal. I, I was looking at it for, oh, I don't know, quite a few, maybe a couple of weeks. And I, I thought, you know what, I'm going to do it. I'm going to buy this thing and see what it's all about. And I got some notes in here. And then I was carrying my field notes in my pocket. And, uh, and, and you know, you can set it in here. And I thought, you know, it would be good to have this instead of carry it in my pocket. So that's why I thought, you know what, let's get this thing. Uh, I don't. You could almost, it could almost double as like kind of a wallet because there's so many places to put stuff in here, you know, and keep things. But I don't know if it's something you'd want to have that's, you know, it's big. I mean, I, I don't know. But anyway, so the field notes, notebook, tactical notebook cover. Is it worth the money? Yeah, I think it is. It's worth it. Is it something that uh, you can use all the time? Sure is. Will it withstand uh, carpentry, things like this? Sure. So anyway, I hope you guys like this one. It's, it's, it's a short video, but I kind of thought this would be cool because I like this thing. You know, I, f I find myself using it uh, for just anything around the house, wife projects, or uh, sometimes when I'm keeping notes, if I'm going to be doing something around, uh, you know, like my kids will call me and want me to do stuff. I, I have my notebook, so I'll just write it down. And, and these days with me, sometimes <laughs> I don't remember everything. So I got it all right here. And there's something about writing it down versus putting it on a uh, in your phone. I think it's better when you write things down. So anyway, hey, thanks for watching. Uh, hope you guys uh, like this video. And I'll talk to you soon in the next one.